The Chief of Army Staff, Lieutenant General Farouk Yahaya, has restated the commitment of the Nigerian Army to work with the National Center for the Control of Small Arms and Light Weapons, NCCSALW, to check the control and circulation of arms and crimes in Nigeria. General Yahya gave the assurance when a delegation led by the National Coordinator of NCCSALW, Major General Mohamed Diko, retired, paid him a courtesy visit at the Army Headquarters, Abuja. The Army Chief, who attributed the spread of small arms and light weapons in the country as factors responsible for various crimes, ranging from banditry, kidnappings, terrorism, just to mention a few, made case for further strengthening of the nation's border security, among other initiatives. We get the information they do like this, they come here. The best we can do is strengthen our borders, our patrols, our checkpoint and things like that. Uh, that is as much as if they pass through where we know. But we know also the expanse, even the borders that they are. And uh, because of the level of this border, they choose where to go, like I said, in Conaiba and others. And with other criminal elements who hide them various, you know, in other things. So that diplomatic uh, aspect is very important in checking for this. And sometimes, uh, even at Libya before they leave, Depending on what level of diplomacy uh, they can go up to, the highest that uh, something can be done. On his part, the National Coordinator NCCSALW, Major General Mohamed Diko, retired, said the visit was informed by need to partner with the Nigerian Army to check the worrisome trend of importation and local manufacturing of small arms and light weapons in the country. As a major stakeholder, we need to uh, chart a course on how we can uh, stem the tide of uh, illicit small arms in circulation. At least for, 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 for the crisis, the security situation we are having today is the availability of small arms and light weapons in the hands of non-state actors. So if we take it away from non-state actors, if we are able to find a way by which we can control uh, their acquisition, then uh, we will reduce these security challenges to the barest minimum. President Muhammadu Buhari approved the establishment of the National Center for the Control of Small Arms and Light Weapons in May 2021, with mandates to address emerging threats and strengthen the regional mechanism for the control, prevention, and regulation of small arms and light weapons. Palang Booker, CNN News.